Hey, what's going on guys? It's the best one, eh? Nice easy stroll to work. I, uh, last night I actually filmed, uh, I have filmed a, a, a vlog last night. barely could hear me talking, so, I don't know, I wasn't sure why, why it was doing that, and, uh, well, anyway, man, I haven't been on a bike probably in, like, three weeks, and yesterday was the first time that I got a chance to, to take her out for a ride, uh, I worked early in the morning, got off probably around uh, three, three, four, somewhere around there, and uh, I said, man, you know, we head home and let me uh, get her, you know, get her back together. I had took the header off because I made a copy of the header for a buddy of mine, another fuel rider, so, uh, which uh, wasn't exactly as easy as I kind of thought it would be, because I had to remember how I did a lot of things, it's probably been like, and a half since I've done it. And, uh, but anyway, I got it done. Got the bike back together. Um, actually ended up making a little change on my header. And uh, and now just out for a nice uh, nice ride to work. I'm actually heading, I'm gonna head across the Beacon Bridge. I'm gonna run nine south. So I figure I'll take that, run that down. Um, it should drop. It actually will drop me out by Bear Mountain. Unless I was to take the other way, which I think is like 9N or something to that effect. So, yeah, so I, I've been I've been gone for a little while. I mean, I've still been around. I try to film when I can. I try to watch, you know, a few videos that I could watch. Um, I uh, I actually. It was, uh, it was my wife and I's second anniversary on August 4th, so we, uh, we ended up going down to uh, a resort called uh, Pocono Palace down in uh, Pennsylvania, over there in Pocono, uh, right off of the 209. Really nice, really nice area, um, a lot to, well, uh, I, I, wanted, I could say a lot to see, I don't know, you might be lying, but uh, it was... It was, it was fun. They, they give you, you know, while you're on the resort, they give you a lot of things to do. Um, you had the, uh, the paddle boats, which kind of sucked. You know, it just, they were kind of, they seemed kind of outdated. It kind of seemed like they, they needed to spend a little bit more money on the place, you know, a little bit more updating. The rooms were nice, you know, it was, it was a cool room. It's a little cheesy, but you know what? It's it's basically that whole love theme. You know what I mean? So yeah, it was a little cheesy, but at the same time, it, it was cool. So you can you can live with it. Don't get me wrong. So um, yeah, we were out there. We did robo and we did dinner, um, and you know we basically had a lot of fun. We just basically we had a chance to enjoy each other's company because you know once you have kids it's like sometimes you really don't get to enjoy each other's company you know because it's like especially if you have more than one it's like you kind of always tend to their needs you know 90 percent of the time and um you know it was just really nice to uh you know to get to spend some time together and i think it was duly 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 needed because you know, the both of us are always really busy. Me, I'm always busy with work. She tends to be, you know, busy with the kids, their planning, and just everything else that pretty much goes along with it. So, you know, we, 
both kind of end up with a lot on our plate and we just end up trying to balance things out so yeah and then the bike's just been apart for the last week so you know i kind of just haven't really gotten a chance to get anything done for the most part but um at any rate uh, yeah so i've been working on the header little by little as you know when i get the chance to which kind of wasn't often and uh ended up getting that done and like i say i'm just happy that i was able to get it finished and completed so so now we're back together we went on a little ride last night to go pick up some chinese food in which i ended up getting a nice chance to use my uh my little tail back there if you remember that video um i could actually fit the food in there and uh you know get it home without having it hanging on the handlebars or some crazy crap like that and um yeah it was cool i couldn't complain couldn't complain at all a hazy day so i've been checking out a few newer newer vloggers and um one of the vloggers that i wanted to give a little shout out to well, i actually did get a shout out yesterday but we're doing today again uh maz gordy maz gordy vlogger she rides a uh, honda grom nice little bike and she's out there um if i'm not mistaken is it the uk or ireland one of those two um and um <laughs> she has a cool accent man check out some of her vlogs you know she has some she has some some cool stuff um i tend to watch her vids whenever i get the chance to along with a lot of the usual other suspects and um it's always good stuff I gotta get that screw another turn uh, say hello to Well, I'm just glad to uh, be able to get out and give you guys another another vlog because I know it's been a while and I haven't exactly gotten a chance to Thank you So I haven't actually gotten a chance to really vlog at all lately in the last few days. So it's uh it's just nice to to get out and, and get a get a little bit of get a little bit of vlogging in. Uh, I, so I've been checking out a few videos, uh, checking out the, uh, the the Utah run videos from. Uh, Triple X Deadhead, Sean Smoke. Um, just some awesome videos, man. This, you know, they, they, they took this ride out to uh, Zion National Park, and I've seen videos of not Zion National Park before. Uh, a while ago, a gentleman, he, he, he took a ride out there on, I believe, was a, a Honda Shadow 750 not mistaken that's what the bike was and and actually what he did he was he would he would camp out there and it was just phenomenal also man the views 
just amazing so yeah so this is where they were they were out here they were riding around in uh utah out there by Zion national park and uh it was just it was really nice man that was, was just some was some amazing views just, you know that was definitely a ride i wish i really wish i could have made i'd have loved to have made it there because that's just it's just beyond amazing you know i don't think i don't think most people really would get to take a trip like that on a you know on a daily basis so if you if you do get a chance to you know definitely something to take advantage of because you <laughs> it's just mind-blowing you know it's just mind-blowing the things that you see you know a camera could never i mean a camera will do do it some justice but a camera will never fully fully actually do it justice like how we think we would do it or or how just being there does it you know does for you i should say but when you're actually there it's just night and day it's night and day difference you know totally different night and day when you're actually there you know you just can't uh you really can't it's just just amazing and um i thought that for a minute there i was wondering if she was going to turn out because <laughs> I don't know. She looked like she was getting ready to bolt out as soon as that car, that last car made it through. So definitely nice just to be back out on the bike, man. Shit. You know, last night I was on it, I was riding it, and it, like, it took me a while just to adjust. I had to actually adjust to, um, to, to being on a bike again. Just, you know, the sound, the feel, um, you know, I had to adjust to all of these things. Just to being on the two wheels again, because you figure every day, like two and a half, three weeks, I was just driving to work. Like, man I get on a bike and I'm like wow this is great <laughs> this is such a great feeling just to be uh, back on a back on a bike again you know yeah shit I'm at 26 minutes wow I didn't really think I was recording that much 